Hi guys, what we're going to be cooking today is a beautiful Italian dish. Tomato basil risotto with roasted chicken. I'm going to be using some drumsticks for this dish. Um, packed with flavour. Yes, take a little time to cook but they're absolutely worth it, fantastic. Okay, so cut down to the bone, turn, keep turning. Scrape. Get it right up there. And once the bone is clean, bottom of the knife, and smack. And look at that, nice for presentation. Look really good on a plate, nice clean bone, and that'll cook better too. You season your chicken, salt. Turn, more salt there. Pepper. Okay, we're going to put some colour on this chicken and the pan's really hot. Olive oil in. Chicken in. Turn your chicken. So that's what we want. Nice golden brown. And then we're going to put it in the oven. Beautiful. Risotto, absolutely fantastic dish. Once you've cracked it, you can put anything to it. So what I've got here is some chicken stock. And what we're going to do, we're going to flavour it. So what I've got here, I've got some boxwood basil, and it's unbelievable how much flavour this brings out. So what we're going to do, we're going to perfume the stock. So put that in, I've got one clove of garlic, and all we've got to do is we're going to press it, the garlic in, and just give it a stir. And when you're making risottos, always flavour your stock. This is the gem of the risotto. And I've put some basil in there, and what's that going to do? That's going to infuse some more basil flavour with the tomatoes when I make the risotto. Fantastic. I've got some peeled tomatoes, and what I'm going to do, I'm just going to scrunch them down. And this is packed with flavour. We're going to chop some celery. And celery and onion is a really good base to a risotto. That's your onion. Okay, so your stock is ready for the risotto. Everything's ready. And make sure that everything's warm, not cold. I've got a pan on the medium heat. Add some olive oil in. Next, add the onion and celery in. Add a pinch of salt in. And you want to sweat these for about five minutes. And after five minutes, add a splash of white wine, dry. Now reduce the wine until it's almost evaporated. And look, can you see? Almost evaporated, and that's packed with flavor. Beautiful. I'm going to be using arborio rice. So what I do, it's like one handful per person, about 70 grams. Very important. Risotto is all about heat control. If your heat is too high, it can be cooked on the outside and raw in the middle. So you've got to have like a balanced heat. And I would say on a medium heat. And cook your rice until it's translucent. So now ladle in your stock, a little bit of a time. And you want to keep stirring it all the time until the stock is absorbed. And when it's absorbed, add more in. And repeat the process. When your first ladle of stock is absorbed, add in some tomato paste. And this will give it a beautiful colour. And cook it out for about two minutes. Okay now, so halfway through the cooking process, add your tomatoes in. Now give everything a good stir, and when the liquid is absorbed, add in more stock. Okay, let's have a taste of this. And like I said, it's very important to taste. So let's have a taste. It's still chalky. Um, it's not pleasurable to the palate. Um, and if it's like that, then cook it more. But always stir and taste. Taste, taste, taste. Very important to taste. But that is not done yet. Some more cooking. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful and creamy. So let's have a taste. Mm. Now it's not chalky. Now it's al dente. Perfect. So now what we're going to do, turn the heat off. Add in basil. In. Pinch of salt. Ground black pepper. Some butter in, some parmesan cheese in, a little bit of olive oil. Now this is what makes the risotto creamy. So take out your spatula or your spoon, put the lid on, remember the heat is off, and forget about it for two minutes. So 
there you have it guys, that's my beautiful rustic Italian dish. Tomato basil risotto with a roast chicken and some nice crusty bread. So let's tuck in, let's get some of that risotto on that bread. Oof. Let's have a taste. Mm. What I like to do, I just like to get the chicken and eat it. Mm. Beautiful. Give this one a go guys. Thanks guys. <laughs>